the 101st thank you sir a very warm welcome to everyone to the 101st knowledge sharing session of ohr today that is on 20th of august 2022 at 6 pm and i am sukriti chetri and i'll be your mc for today and for today's session topic is a little hatke jhatke which is no more drama using three vital questions and mr prantik and this session is going to be a powerful problem solving and leadership skills one so buckle up guys and uh, moving forward with the agenda let's continue as you all know the importance that the supreme almighty hold in our life i request everyone to please come together for the prayers and repeat after me oh god oh god bless all with health and wealth bless all with health and wealth bless all with money and harmony bless all with money and money and harmony oh god oh god bless all with peace and bliss bless all with peace and bliss bless all with wisdom and your devotion bless, bless all with your wisdom and devotion thank you everyone let's move towards which dear all as you are aware that ohr is primarily an informal self help group of and for ohr on hr professionals including those in the ir and allied professions as well as researchers who have passion to do better all the time indian industry has the capability and potential to make a huge contribution in building better india ohr believes that now hr professionals need to be ready to help industry and achieve this goal ohr was started 8 years ago as a self help group and ohr connects to thousands of hr professionals working across various types of industry and every month a session is arranged for sharing knowledge and experience it is over overwhelming to see that we have been able to positively influence thousands of hr now you can also become a knowledgeable sharing member by paying an annual fee and get multiple benefits of it of which um, sir will also be sharing the details in the chats and uh, with this we invite you to become a part of this knowledge sharing journey and you'll be added to many whatsapp groups telegram groups as well we are available on all digital platforms such as facebook linkedin instagram telegram etc for more details please connect Prashant Tapi sir, founder of OHR, and with that OHR has also initiatives like Power Key Breakfast Series, OHR's PSR People, Sustainability Responsibility Program, specially designed for college students, and OHR's WWW, not World Wide Web, but Women with Wings. Moving forward with the agenda, I would like to take the honor to introduce our speaker. Mr. Prantik Pangirahi, sir, had completed his Bachelor of Computer Science from University of Pune. He is India's first certified three vital questions facilitator, global psychometrics facilitator, internationally licensed healer, AI seminar leader, NLP practitioner, diploma in experimental education, a life coach, business coach, and a parenting coach as well. His other credentials include certified aura reader, certified chakra reader and healer, licensed access bar part practitioner, panic healer. He also underwent trainings from various reputed institutions like NIS, Sparta, Mumbai, Heart Inspired, USA, Holistic Living Center, Feeling Minds, and many more. He has, to his credit, many prestigious awards. as a training manager for max new york life for insurance sector he has been consulting and coaching many practitioners participants right from students to ceo of different organizations his major work for 64 plus organizations has resulted in a stupendous increase in sales managing differences for better teamwork and helped them grow better as an individual with the mission of lift people better than found he started facilitating on various topics to help individuals and organizations and other employees on human potential life 
and with this if to talk about sir i think we can go on and on and on but uh, right now sir i wish you to please come forward and continue with the session thank you so much thank you gratitude all of you and uh, especially advocate uh, shailendra deshpande who uh, gave me this opportunity invited me over here and if he's here in this room then uh, gratitude thank you so much uh, i have with me my team member my business partner uh, rupa you can see her name as radiant rupa she is there and uh, she will be uh, taking care of the hind side even during this uh, session this program i request all of you to sit with pen and diary because there are a lot of notes to be taken and uh, people who have just logged in i will just like to share that uh, we have not kept a separate question answer session at the end in the process i will be asking a lot of question it will be interactive i'll be asking you will be sharing you'll you'll be asking i'll be ask, uh, answering the question so in between based on the topic or the slide that we are going on uh, you you can all uh, contribute in sharing by using the emoticons of raise hand if you like certain slide then please put thumbs up and if you really want me to start right now then put a thumbs up right now let's do a practice okay i got one two yes 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 okay okay uh, great fantastic okay so uh, um let, let's start off this program is basically called as no more drama no more drama no more victim ye naam kya hai kaisa hai i'll be using two languages hindi and english anybody who is not comfortable with hindi anybody let me, let me check that first okay anybody who is not comfortable you can you can unmute just see if you can unmute and talk to me let let us just check mr mahesh can you just uh, unmute and let us see if you can unmute and talk okay you can yes we can fantastic so so yes okay uh, anybody anybody not comfortable with english great perfect so i'll be using both the languages so so that it is very easy for me to pass on the information or the message that i have uh, no more drama no more victim so okay let's talk about this part why why is this so okay why is this this name given to this topic okay no more drama so let's let's talk about any of the drama okay what do you see in a drama okay you can you, let it be a movie let it be a stage drama anything what do you see in a drama you can put in the chat box right or you can unmute and answer emotions emotions perfect what else entertainment entertainment perfect what else suspense hmm suspense oops amol says unnecessary things unnecessary things perfect acting skills sorry yeah did, did she come? acting skills acting you you see acts right you see people acting right great enough is enough enough is enough no nee, what do you see in a drama enough effective enough. effective no, no now no more okay <laughs> okay effective dialogue dialogues okay dialogue delivery right okay now all these things are done by whom human beings human right there are characters in the in the drama so uh, first there are characters the characters interact they have dialogue dialogue passing on communication in that communication it some it can be sometimes good communication it can be sometimes bad communication bad communication leads to uh, hurtful sentiments that is emotions good communication leads to love and very powerful emotion that is an emotion okay then there is a villain there is a there is a one who is victim one who is a superhero comes and saves the day so all these things are we uh, something that we see in a movie in a drama now just bring that in your work life bring all these things in your personal life don't you see there is a drama happening every day in our office yes one is a villain one is a victim one is one is the one who is coming no 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 problem i'll support you everything will be right somebody comes and says complains about something one ek dukhiyari hamesha rehta hai okay so, some lady in the personal life mere karan arjun aayenge so all these things are happening in in our day to day life okay so this is all drama 
now at what one point what happens is this drama becomes very tiring it it's very exhaustive and at that time we say to ourselves in our mind no more drama okay so that's how this program is all about so let's see let's see how the, how do we get into dramas so uh, be ready there is a lot of things to be written and a lot of things to be uh, interacted with uh, the the basic tool that we'll be using today is called as three vital questions uh, three important question it's a very powerful tool which can help us deal with any kind of conflicts any drama in our personal life and professional life so the first activity okay be ready please draw a house Antik, if you can give a disclaimer, please. Okay, ah, huh. the disclaimer. Ah, uh, this is not what it looks like. It is a hot green tea. I know it's a Saturday evening. Okay, but it's my hot green tea just to soothe my throat. Nothing else. A disclaimer. Okay, the first activity: draw a house. And once you have drawn, it, it is no uh, drawing competition. Once you have drawn, please bring it close to the camera and uh, let me see what have you drawn. Okay, Sukriti. Okay, yes, got it. Pranav, yes, got it. Pranav, thank you. Yes, Advocate Shailendra. थोड़ा सा कैमरा के नजदीक लाइए आई नॉट एबल टू सी हाँ यस गॉट इट गैलेक्सी ए फिफ्टी टू इफ यू कैन री नेम योर सेल्फ यस महेश जी थैंक यू सो मच आई गॉट इट एनी बडी एल्स रविंद्र आपका देख नहीं पाया हम ड्रॉइंग हाँ जो भी ड्रॉ किया है देर इज नॉट ड्रॉइंग कॉम्पिटिशन जो भी ड्रॉ किया है घर ड्रॉ किया है अपने कुछ ना कुछ तो ड्रॉ किया है दिखाइए ना Yeah, Sampat. Thank you, Sampat. Sampat, thank you so much. Got it. Purnima, thank yeah, you Purnima, so much. Yeah, Purnima, thank you. Uh, great, great. So, when I asked you to draw a house, you had all the options in the world, but mostly you ended up drawing similar to this, right? Right. Right. Now, now a question: Why did you draw this house? Childhood practice. Childhood practice. One. What else? Easy to draw. We we con we concentrate on the structure part, not the people part. Okay, but why 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 was the structure this way? A tapering roof. Okay, a window, a door that way. Why why this way? It is easy to draw. It's easy to draw. Perfect. Childhood practice. Easy to draw and. and basic house basic house it's a basic house right okay yeah, so now it says essential needs fulfilled ah easy okay. to communicate is easy it's very easy to draw perfect so now now easy uh, to communicate easy to communicate also perfect yeah so let now let's ask this question to ourselves are we living in such a house no no have we ever lived in such a house yes for for few people yes for few people no are the houses being built this way today no no the construction technology has changed why did we end up drawing this house childhood practice easy to draw easy to communicate and this is how we are habituated which means that there is a pattern which has got set how to draw the house the technology of building the houses has changed the structure of the houses the houses that we live in it has changed but the the picture of the house in our mind has not upgraded so this is the time right now to upgrade the structure entire structure that we have that we have been carrying in mind in our mind so uh, as as sukriti introduced okay these are few of the credentials that i have earned in last 16 years and i was also awarded for my contribution in organizational development in 2020 and 2021 i did not put that slide so now let's un understand let's let's see this evolution of the computers as the computers started to evolve the first computer that you can see the white color 
somewhere 20 years, 25 years back, you could see such a computer. And if you had such a computer, then ah, amazing, you're, you're a super rich person. Now this computer started to evolve and the way it evolved, the processor became faster and faster and the size became slimmer and smaller. The speed increased, but the size started to decrease. Now the laptops, uh, the computers do not look like computers anymore. They have become watches, they have become tablets. They don't even look like computers anymore. Now the hardware of the, 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 the tangible touch of the hardware, it gives an idea, it gives a, a illusion that hardware decides how the software will work. But actually it is the other way around, software will decide how the hardware will operate. Every month on your mobile, on your laptop, you get a, get a pop-up message. What is that message about? Update. Update. Why? Why do you get that? Developers keep on adding new features. Right. And what will happen if you don't update? It will not function. I will not get the required. Perfect. It will not function to its optimum. You will not get the required outcome, the result, and it will be sluggish in nature, which will irritate you. So this is how the computers have been evolving. The structure of the house have evolved. So let's talk about human evolution. The human started to evolve this way, and the physical body that we have today was structured around two lakh years back. Two lakh years back, our Hardware of the body got structured, got designed. This is, the, this is the way the body will be operating. So the upgradation of the hardware is nowhere possible today. The only way we as humans can upgrade is by upgrading our operating system. Computers have, have operating system, mobiles have operating system, but the, our, uh, we also have, our mind also is an operating system. We need to upgrade our operating system only then we as humans will evolve in much more better way. So let us understand what is this human operating system. It is basically how you view the world. It's like a lens. Okay, through that lens, the lens will filter the complex reality and it will filter and give the data that we prefer to have. Okay, so let's understand. Let's, ex let's experience something. What is the color of my shirt? White. White. Okay, so let's talk about this part. So my, my, uh, the shirt color is white. So Mahesh Ji, let, let me ask you a question because I can see you right now. Uh, since how many years have you been wearing your specs? Seven years. Seven years. Uh, having worn the specs for seven years, uh, it has become a part of your body? Yes. You have got used to wearing this specs? Yes. Do you consciously remember that you are wearing a specs? No. No, because it has become part of the body. And has it ever happened, you are wearing the specs, still looking out for specs? It happened today, actually. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Very interesting. Okay. Why? Because we are so used to it. That's how the operating system is. We are so used to uh, use the, our operating system and we are oblivious that something like this exists. Now, I have got a task, a gift for you, Mr. Mahesh. Okay, at around 8.30, you'll receive a parcel at your doorstep. The parcel is a spectacle. But uh, the spectacle does not have the stick on the side. It has soft leather and Velcro behind. Okay, and whatever number you have, I was, I was so glad that uh, Advocate Shailendra Deshpande was able to grab the number of your glass. He gave it to us and we are delivering that same glass to you. So you'll, you'll have to wear that glasses from tonight itself. The condition is you'll have to keep on wearing that glass for 24 hours a day, 365 days a year and for next seven years. So now the new specs that we give, you'll also get used to that specs after seven years. If I use, then yes, probably yes. So the condition is, the task is you have to keep on wearing. Now, Kahani may twist. The specs will have exact number that you have, but the color of the specs is red color. Oh. <laughs> now, please tell me, if you keep wearing that specs for seven years, 
this tinted glass will you also get used to this color sorry last question i could if you keep on wearing this color glass for next 7 years 24 hours a day you will get used to this color yes certainly now sukruti and mahesh will meet after 7 years okay you meet uh, you you live in pune sir yeah okay so you both meet somewhere at the uh, fc road at uh, after 7 years sukruti will say wow such beautiful world the the world is full of white color green color black color gray color what will you say sir i will say only red color now if you start to convince each other she says world is multicolor you say world is red color who is right both are right in their own perspective because own perspective. she has seen the world with different colors i have seen last yeah. seven years only one color exactly now if you do if you are not able to convince each other what will it lead to there will be debate will not conclude drama drama <laughs> so this is how the drama starts off the drama starts because everybody has their own operating system everybody has their own lens sukruti or rather uh, shailendra deshpande he is wearing a specs which is uh, a different color you are wearing a specs which is red in color and now both are debating what will be the end result drama and this exactly this is the lens which provides the basic information about the world we create our assumptions because of this lens we create our beliefs because of this lens and majorly what happens is these lenses or this operating system influences our behavior why we behave the way we do is based on this lens what's the idea so so uh, do we have a operating system and as uh, apple has ios okay uh, the other phones have android do we have an operating system that can be named the answer is yes we have an operating system and we can identify the operating system by this word fisb f i s b e it is not frisbee but frisbee f i s b e what is this okay let's decode that but again an experience again a top choose a car any of you okay please put in the chat box or unmute and sh share which car would you like to have with you <clears throat> a or b which car would you like to have i will prefer b b okay anybody else yeah kiran purnima dipshika says b a lot of answers are coming in okay great you can choose any car i'm not going to give any of them so <laughs> i'm happy <laughs> so you choose any of the cars okay just visualize okay i just want you to visualize yourself in that car how would you like to use this car how would you like to drive in this car the, the car that you have chosen a or b would you like to see yourself and the car along the hill side with your loved one with your family with some soft music going on and enjoying the entire weather would you like to see yourself this way or would you like to see yourself and the car this way <laughs> No, okay how many for one how many for two first picture or second picture one one right obviously one. right we always want the good things however uh, taking the car to garage is a good idea or not yeah for regular maintenance yes. for regular maintenance once a while it is a good idea however just answer this question once a while taking the car to garage is good however if your car needs maintenance out of 30 days 12 days is your vehicle in optimum state no 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 okay and do you think your vehicle is highly efficient no no not at all right so 12 uh, 12 out of 30 days if your car is in garage the, that means you it is time now to change the car okay it is not optimum it is not efficient at all now from this metaphor let me take you take it to your organization what if 12 out of 30 days which is actually 40% 40% of the time managers spend their productive time in managing conflicts and managing differences among employees 
if the manager is spending more time in over there do you think organization is performing in optimum level no and do you think organization profitable i think not at all right so now i really want you to go back okay just check it out okay just think over go back to your last month or go back to your last two or three weeks how many hours a day or how many days in a week how many days in a month did you spend your time in just managing conflicts you can you can put in the chat box or you can unmute and answer go back to your last month how many days how many hours sampat says 12 mm is it actually 40% okay 12 hours he says um, 12 hours in a in a week or in a month just a moment i'll just check it out okay so the, the whole idea is you have been spending some time some time of your productive time into managing conflicts okay now how does it affect the productivity we'll see that in some time now how do you identify your own operating system why do two people get into conflicts like for example mr mahesh and mr deshpande uh, they both will get into conflict because of their operating system the lens so how come two people have different fisb what what is the reason that two people have different operating system that is fisb and how do they get into conflicts let's look at it uh fisb is basically a mental model and it's an acronym and this mental model it it is suitable for all right from the childhood till the adulthood at any age this mental model works and it is by default human operating system so f over here means focus is over here means inner state or your emotional state be here means behavior your action your act if i have to make it very simple focus is think inner state is feel behavior is act think feel and act okay but uh, fisb becomes very easy for us to remember now how does it operate let's see how many of you like sea beach you can use a uh, uh, thumbs up thumbs up okay how many of you like sea beach mm -hmm. okay quite a few great so just imagine yourself that this evening you are standing on a beach one of your favorite beach it is evening time it's dusk the sun is setting you are able to see the ocean waves you can feel the breath of the breath okay it has got beautiful uh, fragrance in the evening and while you are enjoying that evening you you look towards the left side and when you look towards your left side you see a couple this way now if you look at this couple and you're standing here what what is the first thought that comes in your mind how how is this couple beautiful beautiful okay i wish i had a partner like this okay you wish you had a partner like this okay great i will remember my younger days acha <laughs> you remember your younger days fantastic okay L lot of sparks right now huh? mahesh ji <laughs> <laughs> enjoying romantic nice romantic. couple enjoy nice this couple. time enjoying together perfect perfect now the the idea is not to disturb the idea is to interview and actually get to know you go to this couple and you just ask them bhai sir ben ji आपको यहाँ पे इस माहौल में कैसा लग रहा है हाउ आर यू फीलिंग एट दिस मोमेंट वॉट इज द आंसर यू विल रिसीव फ्रॉम दम
enjoying the nature or could be we are thinking about our future ah we are enjoying the nature we are thinking about our future it's nice it's nice how beautiful the nature is how beautiful the nature is right and agar koi zyada hi poetic agar honge un dono mein se hum chahte hain waqt yahi tham jaye right aise bhi kuch ho sakta hai why are you disturbing us <laughs> why are you disturbing us <laughs> that, that could be another possibility yes 100% So the whole idea is uh, you'll get some good responses. Now you shift your focus towards your right hand side, and you see this couple. What is the first thought you see? Not gelling well with their own thought process. Not gelling well. Okay, great. What else? Maybe they have conflict in between us. Uh, they, they could be in fight. They could have some conflicts between them. Conflict. Yeah. Yeah. What else? Difference in opinion. Difference in opinion. Giving each other space. Not uh, really. I think they must be taking some uh, act, uh, position for a photo shoot or something. Huh. Let's let's uh, let's say let's for example, photo. there is no camera. Nothing. Nothing. But uh, once you see this way, the first thought that comes in. Okay. Not happy. Not happy. Sad. Okay. Sad. Now no communication. The Now the same thing. Idea is not to disturb, but to interview them. Bhai sa, Benji, apko is mahol me kaisa lag raha hai? How how are you feeling at this moment? What is the answer? False quarrel. Ah, feeling false disturbed. Ah, they are disturbed. Okay, we are disturbed. Don't disturb us. We are already disturbed. <laughs> we are in bad mood. Please go away. Ah, uh, we are in bad mood. Please go away. Okay. So, so let's see. Okay. Now, now you are able to identify that just looking at these two people, these two couple, you are able to identify what feeling they are going through. And when you interviewed, you got two different responses. But please tell me, for both of them, they it's the same external environment. They are on the same beach. just 10 feet away from each other they are in, on the same beach why do you think they are responding differently why they are responding differently they might be going through the different phases of their life ha huh, exactly however why they are responding differently the, the external environment is same na they are on the sea beach such a beautiful beach internal uh, situation for both of them Ah, internal situation. They both have two different internal human orientation or operating system. They are operating from a different. Somebody is operating from iOS. Somebody is operating from Android. Right. So that way. So two different internal human orientation gives birth to two different responses of behavior. Now let's put it in the Fisby model. The first couple over here. Where do you think their focus is? they focused on the commonalities common points common and uh, put one more adjective the first couple common is focusing points on common points and they are showing interest in that discussion they are showing interest they are uh, they are uh, finding good common points okay mm -hmm. they are finding good common points their focus is everything that is happening good in their life everything that is happening good at this present moment their focus is over there so now tell me with that kind of focus with that kind of thought what will be their emotional state happy happy right and what kind of behavior they they gave to you or they showed it to you when you interviewed them sharing right it was sharing it was responsive okay they they did, they did not shun you okay they were responsive towards it now let's go back to the second couple what is their focus where are they focusing most of the time bad side the bad side the negative side something that is not happening well in their life something that is upsetting them something that is triggering them something that is not happening good in their life and what kind of inner state or emotional state they have right now disturbed inner stuff okay sad anxiety sad. right lot many things frustrated irritated mental mental stress they they are going through stress and what kind of behavior they are they display to you they are not cooperating to each other they are not 
and what did what action did they show you when you interviewed them they were angry on me exactly anger anger they they displayed anger so now my my dear participants my dear friends now please tell me especially the let's talk about the second couple did they show their anger because of the problem or did they show anger because of their irritated emotional state Because Emotion. of the continue. Sukriti wanted to tell. Yes, sir. The same answer. Yes, I guess the emotional state. The emotional yes. state. Emotionally, they were disturbed. That's why the they acted differently. They acted in anger. Now, a question: Which part or which behavior? I mean, uh, the focus in a state of behavior out of these three circles, which circle is visible to us? behavior is visible right and that is where all the judgment start and that is where all the judgment start and that is where we start to create the beliefs about that person are ye hamesha gussa hi karta hai ye chidki hi baat karta hai ye khadoos hai ye sab aaya kahan se because of the behavior but nowhere have we ever thought about what is the inner state that person is going through external environment can be anything but the internal environment is something that we have never fo focused upon we always ask what did you do today we never ask to our colleagues how are you feeling today and that makes the hell lot of difference okay and the challenge over here is most of us have one default orientation okay by default hamara by default behavior hoi jata hai क्या है लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड सो इन ओल्ड ओल्डन टाइम्स द द सेलर्स दे यूज्ड टू यूज अ टूल टू फाइंड द डायरेक्शन व्हाट वाज दैट कंपास एग्जैक्टली द मैग्नेटिक कंपास नाउ व्हाट व्हाट इज द स्पेशलिटी ऑफ दिस कंपास मेंटल ऑलवेज फाउंड द डायरेक्शन ऑलवेज नॉर्थ एंड साउथ बाय डिफॉल्ट okay you put it anywhere in on this earth it will by default point north so that is the default orientation of this magnetic compass and because of that default orientation the sailors could find the way so now um, you all have to unmute yourself yeah. this okay loudly would you like to go through this experience okay what if me and rupa will put you into a stuffed tube and head first would you like to go through this experience yes hello yes no. okay. second it will be a cold tube and very confining matlab just stiff ho jayenge aap andar hil nahi paoge you can you can't no. move would you like to go through that no 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 okay just just to add up uh we will be putting you for at least 3 to 4 hours single stroke would you like to go through it no no and what if uh, you are there inside the tube and i will start making very screeching sound loud noise like scratching metal from outside would you like to absolutely explain? absolutely no absolutely no okay so mr vikram i have got a question for you would you believe that people volunteer to do this no no the volunteer they don't volunteer they volunteer for mri <laughs> no right mr vikram no they no are who, who the vikram they are, they are forced to do no. that because of sickness they will be compelled they will be they compelled. compelled compelled but the thing is when the doctor says that you will have to go and do mri yes. they don't reject the way you reject yes. it now situation will decide yes situation i am not doubting that part but the moment doctor tells that you have to go through mri they say yes they pay lakhs of rupees and they still do mri right but my question was when i showed you this why did you reject what was happening when you when you were seeing or reading these lines imagining so we thought of uh, 
we thought of all negative points exactly you thought of all negative points the imagination was you saw yourself being stuffed you saw yourself claustrophobic suffocating inside that cold tube and i making sound from or kar kar sound that would have irritated you even by imagining right that is our default orientation our default orientation is to first think negative the moment we see an opportunity the moment we see any challenge the moment we uh, face any kind of situation the first thought comes in kya bura hoga what else can go wrong ab kya takleef aa gaya ab kyu ho raha hai ye sab itna plan karke bhi gadbad kyu ho raha hai yes or no these are very common dialogues so our default orientation is by default negative and uh, are we trained for that no it is evolutionary the human evolution that i spoke about after uh, some time back the humans the way they survive the neanderthal people the caveman people they survive because of fear okay wo darte the isliye wo survive ho paaye darte the isliye raat ko shikar ke liye nahi gaye wo darte the isliye cave se zyada dur shikar ke liye nahi gaye okay because of their fear they could survive and that's why we are here so our default orientation and we have that uh, animalistic brain the reptilian brain that we all know so we have that reptilian brain which is fight and flight so the first thought is to think negative that is our default orientation so what is our default orientation our focus first goes to the problem kya problem hai okay i'll i'll just give you an example something that i had read many years back and i i created a joke out of it uh, one of the employee was reading newspaper uh, in the office just to go through what's happening so he was going through and he read uh, so two lakh job people were sacked from their job okay there is recession there is lack of job okay people are being fired so he is reading all this in the newspaper two minutes later the peon comes and says uh, saab aapko बड़े साहब ने बुलाया अंदर वॉट विल बी द फर्स्ट स्टेट ऑफ थॉट समबडी मस्ट हैव टोल्ड अबाउट माय न्यूज़पेपर रीडिंग कंप्लेंट नहीं नहीं वाइल ही इज रीडिंग कि दो लाख नौकरी चले गए मेरा नंबर आएगा नहीं कहीं मेरा नंबर तो नहीं आ गया फर्स्ट थॉट गोज ओवर देयर ओके इंक्रीमेंट हो सकता है तब नहीं थॉट आता है ओके सो वो चीज सो आर आर इनर स्टेट becomes anxiety when we are focusing on problem our inner state is very anxious okay uh, it can be sad unhappy frustrated i just used one word for for uh, easy communication and the behavior is always reactive and uh, as per psychology we have these four basic behaviors fight flight freeze and appease we always use these okay in uh, and and or combination with one relationship we can use fight with one relationship we use flight we, with one relationship we use freeze and with one relationship we use appease okay do we can we use all the four in one relationship the answer is yes uh, answer is yes okay so now let, let's say for example your first behavioral reaction is fight that means out of 10 whenever you you are anxious you choose fight as a response so that becomes your behavioral response now takes 30 seconds write this four and write down the chronological order which is your first default behavioral style or reactive style most of the time what do you use and that is by default means you don't plan it but it happens Pantik, if you could explain maybe uh, flight an and appease. I'll, I'll give you an example. I just wanted to write now, so so that uh, with the explanation, with depth, they will understand in depth. Advocate Shailendra says fight. Mm-hmm. He is advocate. He has to. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> good one. <laughs> flight. Flight for few people. Flight, yeah. Freeze होना यानी सुन होना. अरे अब मैं कुछ नहीं कर सकता. कोई आके मुझे बचाए. Okay, freeze means कोई आके मुझे बचाए. I can't do anything of my own now. Or I am not able to think. Appease is, yeah, छोड़ना. 
हाँ ठीक है मैं मैं अपनी गलती मानता हूँ मेरी गलती है झगड़ा मत करो चलो कर लेते हैं मिलके करते हैं सो दैट इज अपीस दैट इज प्लेकेटर प्लेकेटिंग इट इन सेज मोर फाइट मोर फाइट ओके फेयर इनफ फेयर इनफ ओके सो नाउ नाउ लेट्स सी लेट्स गिव अ वेरी सिंपल एग्जांपल ऑफिस एग्जांपल हम सब ने कभी ना कभी फेस किया है यू टेल योर कॉलीग योर असिस्टेंट हुसोवर इट इज हु गिव्स यू सम रिक्वायर्ड डेटा फॉर एनी काइंड ऑफ मीटिंग सो लेट्स से फॉर एग्जांपल आई टेल माय असिस्टेंट कि लेट्स से फॉर एग्जांपल अभिजीत नाम है उसका अभिजीत कल सुबह 9 बजे मेरा Zoom कॉल है 9:30 बजे मेरा Zoom कॉल है मेरे बॉस के साथ डायरेक्टर के साथ I want these three data on my table at 9 a.m. I will go through it, and 9:30 I will log in and I will share the data. So please ensure that on our budget, right on my table. Next morning when I come and I see the table, there is nothing on table. So a default reaction, whatever is my default reaction that will come up. Let's say for example fight. Okay, you start to fight. Okay, just. Uh, You start to fight. What is fight? You start to raise your voice. You shout. Abhijit, get up! I forgot. I get out. Now, till the time he gives, what is the level of our anxiety? Now, my head is full. I get no tension. Right. And what kind of thought comes? Increase every moment. Ah, uh, uh, anxiety keeps on increasing every minute. Okay, nine thirty until that. I may have, I may have flat face in front of my bosses, senior bosses. Ha! Huh. I I could have a flat face in front of my boss. I will uh, I'll be fallen on my face in front of my bosses. Boss, मेरे बारे में क्या सोचेंगे वो भी हो सकता है. What, What I will do now? What I will do now? Are you seeing infection of second? Just moment the uh, the assistant Abhijit said, मैं भूल गया. मैं अभी तक निकाला नहीं हूँ. करता हूँ. till the time the data does not come look the thought and the anxiety thought and anxiety it has it has increased to high level and, and also we are also keeping on shouting yes mr amul yeah and most productive way is like we can do it together now ha huh, that is what we are we one way of doing it right. we, here we are not thinking about what should have been done or what we could do we are here to examine why we behave the way we do what is happening internally for which my behavior which is visible to all is displayed is exhibited right, right okay. so internally are yaar mein nokri chali jayegi boss mere bare mein kya sochega main yaar main is pe bharosa kyun kiya ye ye nalayak hi hai yaar isko samajhta nahi hai and plus i could go and stand beside jaldi kar yaar tujhe samajh nahi aata till the time he is doing i am also shouting at him anybody has this experience <laughs> many times <laughs> many times right and and i am thinking i am thinking ki chillane se ye shayad jaldi kar jaye Deepshika is also raising. Thank you so much for being honest. So that is what is happening. So within that second, okay, and minute by minute, my my problem thoughts are increasing. At the same time, my anxiety is increasing, and because my anxiety is increasing, my reaction has increased. Now, me chilla liya nine twenty ko mujhe data de diya. Kaise to be retrieve kiya and he gave me the data at nine twenty. Now I am okay. Uh, feeling much better. Feeling much better. Thank you. Okay, we are feeling much better. But now, please tell me, till the time I was shouting at Abhiji. Okay, I was shouting. I was using my fight, shouting. What is the impact of my behavior on my life and the relationship? It's going down and means in a bad way. Hmm? It's going down and down spiral way. Everything must. Messing up. Everything messing up. Okay, we know that. But at the same time, at the same time, we are also creating a lens. Now, what is the lens? Yar, isko chilla ke hi kam hota hai. How many of you agree to it? Right. Now right. I have created a belief about Abhijit. Yar, isko chilla kaun toh hi karta hai? Varna nahi karta. Sirf sirf isko samajhta nahi hai. Now, whenever I have to give task to Abhijit, now what happens? I will give cushioning. No, I'll I'll be I'll be having a very stern voice. Last time, नहीं किया था. This time, कर. Delay मत कर. मेरी band मत बजा. वरना तेरी band बजाऊँगा. 
okay so that is the kind of tone we may not use this language but but the tone will be very stern why because now i have got this belief isko chillate hi kaam hota hai now are you able to relate why few people they always shout and give the task whenever there is a review meeting why they are always shouting because of experience because of the past experience na abhijit ke sath chillaya yaar abhi shayad chilla ke is duniya mein kaam hota hai right sir so now what has become my behavioral style be a commander always be a commander a dictator a shouting person a reactive person so main wo belief leke abhi mere prati log belief rakh rahe hain but my behavioral style is reactive behavior now this has become my default orientation because my thought is ya jisko bhi kaam deta hu na wo waqt pe kabhi nahi karta hai main takleef mein aa jaunga isliye pehle chilla ke hadka ke karo are you able to relate to yes sir okay thank you so much okay okay some feedback some feedback how is the session going on great very interesting interesting you like yeah. it yes okay great, great thank you thank you thank you for the feedback now important part okay now uh, be here so what happened is 9 o'clock i shouted at abhijit by 9:20 he gave me the report okay correct so that means my reaction gave a successful result okay now the, be be very watchful about it my reaction gave a successful result that means the outcome that i desired what happens to the intensity of, of the problem in my mind now it will be less now yes because ab jo itna bada problem dikh raha tha yaar data nahi hoga boss mujhe chillayega ye kaise hoga kya now it has reduced kyun data aa gaya na abhi the intensity of the problem has reduced if the intensity of the problem has reduced what happens to the anxiety intensity of the anxiety anxiety will also reduce reduce it will also reduce and if the anxiety is reduced what happens to the reaction the reactive behavior it will be soft now it will be soft rather it also will be reduced yes now the moment i get the data at 920 after that do i talk to abhijit about this data probably not no do i uh, do, in the entire day or in the entire week do i again help him recall yaar wo late kyun hua maybe no. yes maybe yes maybe no yes okay in most of the cases because the data aa chuka hai aur mera abhi ka kaam 9:30 baje ka kaam ho gaya ab koi problem nahi hai the focus on the problem reduces right so अब प्रॉब्लम नहीं है ना डेटा आ गया ना अभी का काम हो गया वी कॉल दिस एज फिक्सिंग नॉट सॉल्विंग वी जस्ट फिक्स द प्रॉब्लम हमने चिल्लाया वो डर के मारे मुझको डेटा निकाल के दे दिया द प्रॉब्लम गॉट फिक्स्ड फॉर एग्जांपल नल लीक हो रहा है हम एक धागा बांध के थोड़ा सा स्टॉप करते हैं बट डिड वी एक्चुअली सॉल्व द प्लम्बिंग प्रॉब्लम नो नो सर डिड वी एक्चुअली सिट एंड सॉल्व अभिजीत का डिले या प्रोक्रेस्टिनेशन का प्रॉब्लम नो नो बिकॉज मेरा एंजाइटी कम हो गया तो मेरा फोकस ऑन द प्रॉब्लम भी कम हो जाएगा तो नाउ द थिंग इज सिंस द प्रॉब्लम वाज नॉट सॉल्व इट वाज ओनली फिक्स्ड व्हाट हैपेंस टू द प्रॉब्लम इट विल ओकर अगेन रिटर्न ऑफ द प्रॉब्लम लाइक द जोरो रिटर्न्स वैसे द मम्मी रिटर्न्स वैसे now the problem may come from him or may come from somebody else the problem will now be increased bigger in size now the problem came back what happens to the cycle high anxiety high reaction then temporary fixing of the problem then less anxiety then less drive to solve the problem and the cycle continues that is why that is why you see why this person does not understand ek bar bol ke samajhta kyu nahi hai bar bar kyu samjhana pad raha hai the return of the problem because the problem was not fixed problem was not solved it was only fixed got the idea yes sir okay and that is why we call this problem orientation as reactive orientation not problem solving orientation react karke abhi ka problem solve ho jaye abhi ka 
जो जो एंगजाइटी है जो चैलेंज है अभी का सिर्फ अभी का फिक्स हो जाए क्विक फिक्स अभी जान बच जाए अब अभी जान बच जाए अभी मुसीबत से बच जाए फॉर एग्जाम्पल इट इज लाइक एस्प्रिन हेड एक हो रहा है बॉडी एक हो रहा है एस्प्रिन खा लो हो जाओ बट क्यों हो रहा है उसके रूट कॉज तक कभी भी नहीं पहुंचने क्योंकि अभी का प्रॉब्लम सॉल्व हो गया ना बदन दर्द अभी कम हो गया ना सर दर्द कम हो गया अभी सो वी आर ऑलवेज इन टू एस्प्रिन So the problem orientation has one challenge that we we focus on the problem only till the anxiety is reduced. Once the anxiety is reduced, ah, sub set hai. फिर अगले उत्तर तो है फिर क्यों आ रहा है? And that is where we get exhausted और बोलते हैं no more drama. Okay. Now because of this problem reactive orientation, so look at the challenge. Okay. There was a loss of three hundred fifty US billion dollars in productivity loss in productivity. because of the negative behavior continuously happening in organization and because there is a negative behavior managers are spending 40% of their time in managing interpersonal conflicts so whatever we heard earlier is actually a report one was gallup and this one is metal report and this just does not live in our office or workplace it goes in our personal relationships now just ask this question to yourself you need not have to answer this question in the group in the forum or in the chat do you feel stuck okay in in never ending cycle of feeling frustrated hopeless guilty and resentful in some of your relationships also are you constantly trying to fix the same problems but not getting anywhere despite giving all the efforts right just ask this question to yourself and the cycle for this problem reactive orientation in relationship is this way i am trapped i try so hard but nothing ever improves it's over i am quitting and i am not doing this again maybe it wasn't that bad i was being unrealistic and the most important one was if only they change everything would get better are you all able to relate to it yes, yes sir so th this is how it is now again the same thing just look at this what is the impact of problem orientation in your life and in your in your relationships just go back in your relationship part okay in your personal relationship have you been facing such kind of reactive orientation continuously and what is the what is the status of that relationship now strained strained so is there a solution the answer is yes the solution again acha uh, very frankly let me tell you what we are experiencing is an intro session so it is just 10% of the original entire workshop that we're, okay it's just the 10% okay 10% is this knowledgeable okay when once we cover up the entire 90% that is uh, mind breaking and breakthrough lot of breakthroughs so is there a solution the answer is yes a new fisb what is a new fisb everybody please cross your arms okay and look at your arms Okay, which arm is on top? In my case, left arm is on top, right arm is below. Let me just see. Now, remove the hand and then cross it over. Okay, for me, the left hand was on top, right hand was below. Now I have to bring the right hand on the top of it. So whatever it is, your orientation. Okay, do the opposite of it. just remove and cross it the other way you were able to do it all of you yes but uncomfortable yeah uncomfortable yes you will be but how did you do that how did you uh, do the different way amol it, it happened consciously ha ah, yes it happened consciously thank you and while were you doing it amol mr mahesh and everybody else were you observing your arms yes yeah i was looking at the hand you were observing okay yeah, yeah. trial error ha ye yeah. bada dekha ha nahi ye bada aisa thoda sa hua yes <laughs> after three four times so reach do it successfully okay so good news so the new fisbee requires a conscious effort initially it, it could be quite disturbing initially it could be quite uncomfortable but eventually you will be able to do it okay and now if you start 
uh, crossing your arm the other way around right now, the new crossing arms. If you keep on doing it that way, you will also get used to it. Yes, sir. Right? So it yeah. needs a conscious effort. Like for example, Mahesh Ji, ke saath humne kya example liya tha? if he starts wearing this red color glass for next seven years, he'll get used to it. Yes, sir. So as simple as that. So the new Frisbee, again, it's a Frisbee, it's the same mental model, but the orientation will be different now. So new Frisbee, it is called as outcome orientation. The earlier one was problem orientation. This is outcome orientation. Outcome orientation means the first focus goes on outcome. What outcome do I need? Okay, let's take the same example. Abhijit was supposed to give me data at nine o'clock. His data is not ready and I'm feeling frustrated. I'm irritated. I'm, I'm thinking what all can go bad. Okay, okay, okay. So that's my default orientation of crossing my arm. Now I have to be conscious. I'll have to cross my arm the other way around. So I have to be conscious. So I'll take a pause. What is the outcome do I really want? I want this person to learn time management, maybe completing the task on time, whatever it is. That is the outcome I want. Do I want the outcome right now? Well, no, I can coach him later. What is the outcome I want? I want the data to be produced in front of me before 9.30. Also, this relationship should, should relationship should not be scarred. So these are the three outcomes I want. One, that he should learn time management, task management. Second, I want the data now. Third, the relationship should not be spoiled. So now with that kind of idea, what kind of inner state you will experience? Wisdom. Wisdom. Wala. Wisdom. Wala. Uh, so, wisdom. Wala na? Yes, sir. Huh, wisdom. So, uh, wisdom. Wala feel hoga. Moreover, you'll be inspired. You'll be feeling inspired to do something. Uh, solution oriented. Solution oriented. Outcome orientation, solution oriented. But solution kya hai? Wo pehle clear ho jana hai. Solution ye hai ki isko task management sikhna hai. Mujhe mera data bhi chahiye hai abhi saadhe nao se pehle. And third, ये रिलेशनशिप खराब भी नहीं होना चाहिए दैट इज माय सॉल्यूशन दैट इज माय आउटकम आई वांट एंड आई एम फीलिंग इंस्पायर्ड दैट आई विल टीच दिस पर्सन दिस असिस्टेंट दिस फ्रेंड ऑफ माइन ओके ऑल दिस थिंग्स बट नॉट नाउ ओके अभी का जो है मुझे 9:30 को ये आ जाना चाहिए सो नाउ आई विल स्टैंड बिसाइड हिम आई और आई विल गिव हिम स्पेस आई विल आस्क हिम डू यू नीड एनी काइंड ऑफ हेल्प लेट मी नो फॉर रिट्राइविंग एनी डेटा डू यू नीड एनी अदर सपोर्ट फॉर रिट्राइविंग डेटा मैं पूछ लूंगा and then I'll, my behavior will be calm and i'll be taking small baby steps for him to learn task management after my meeting is over so once i complete the meeting i'll make him sit i'll ask him what was the challenge kal kya hua kyun nahi kar paye the subah tak kyun nahi ho paya tha i'll just ask him what is his skill kya aisa bhi ho sakta na he is overburdened by lot of things and he could not say no to me right sir that will only come when i know what is the outcome i am looking for okay provided i am wanting to coach i am wanting to support and i want this relationship a relationship chahiye hi nahi to fir hadka hona kya farq padega okay to chahiye hai then you take small baby steps it's not one day mein sab seekh jana hai okay small daily baby steps okay so focusing on what you really want bring out your inner inspiration you just feel inspired jab kuch ek outcome hota hai kuch goal dikhta hai you feel inspired to do something and next what daily steps you are ready to take to reach the desired outcome are we clear till this point any doubt any question everything is clear till now sir okay great so what are the three vital question okay but let's understand what does three vital question do three vital question is a tool that helps us move from the default problem orientation to problem solving orientation which is outcome orientation we are not fixing the problem we are solving the problem okay and uh, this three bq or three vital question will help us move from judgment to awareness judgment kya tha mera abhijit ke prati judgment kya tha are wo nikamma hai chillane se kaam hota hai that was my judgment my awareness is oh he was so much burdened that he actually did not have enough time and he could not say no to me that's my awareness 
रिएक्टिव क्या था फाइट एक्चुअली आता गधा है तू पागल है तू क्या होगा तो समझ नहीं आता क्यों नौकरी दी मैंने दैट्स माय रिएक्शन रिस्पांस इज हाउ कैन आई सपोर्ट यू इन इन डूइंग द टास्क मैनेजमेंट एंड व्हेन यू डू दैट यू जस्ट डोंट सरवाइव इन दैट रिलेशनशिप यू डोंट सरवाइव इन दैट डिपार्टमेंट और इन द ऑर्गेनाइजेशन यू द ऑर्गेनाइजेशन थ्राइव्स यू थ्राइव विद द ऑर्गेनाइजेशन ओके सो व्हाट आर द थ्री वाइटल क्वेश्चन Where am I putting my focus? I mean, my focus is going to be problem pe or outcome. Pe. Ask this question to all, all the, always to yourself whenever you are going through a task. Second, how am I feeling? What is my inner state? That means, am I anxious or am I feeling inspired? Okay. Third is, what actions am I taking? Am I reactive? I'm using fight, flight. or taking creative action to support coach myself and my team members and my family members now would you like to see how does in which all areas in an organization does this three vital question help yes sir so yes one how does organization gain it creates a non threatening environment why because you are tapping into their thoughts feelings and your your their ideas conveniently it, it creates a non threatening now if somebody is not feeling threatened imagine the the authenticity the integrity happening in the organization agar main abhijit ko 9 baje hi chillane ke badle bol are reh gaya kya okay fine kuch support chahiye abhi 9:30 se pehle tu kar sakta hai de sakta hai data ओके कुछ सपोर्ट चाहिए नॉन थ्रेटनिंग लेकिन मैं चिल्लाया गधा है तू पागल है तू तेरे नौकरी क्यों दी मैंने इट्स अ थ्रेटनिंग एनवायरनमेंट एंड दैट इज वेयर पीपल स्टार्ट टू चीट दे स्टार्ट टू लाई बिकॉज़ इट्स अ थ्रेटनिंग एनवायरनमेंट आई वाज रीडिंग अ बुक ट्यूसडे विद मॉरी बाय मिच एल्बम इन दैट बुक आई हैव अंडरलाइंड द लाइन आई रीड इट इन 2011 और 12 समथिंग एंड आई अंडरलाइंड वन लाइन इन दैट बुक इट सेस पीपल एक्ट मीन पीपल एक्ट मीन व्हेन दे फील थ्रेटेंड Okay, so secondly, it solves differences very easily because it, easy way to address issues behind any misunderstanding and turning into something creative. That that's the most powerful part. It gives clear dire- direction. कहाँ पे जा रहे हैं? Employees will know exactly what is expected from each of them and what are the steps because baby steps included there. अब मुझे अभिजीत को अगर task management सिखाना है, so I'll be giving them him baby steps. I'll be taking baby steps with him and also teaching him baby steps. business success now if everybody is understanding actually what is happening and if i am being understood in my organization my boss understands me i will stay in the organization no? so attrition rate reduces because happy employees gives happy results okay so so these are the few of the outcomes now uh, any, any questions till now any questions no sir all well going on well Very well. Okay, thank you. So, uh, as I mentioned, this is just the ten percent of what uh, the original workshop is all about, uh, because this is just one part of it. There are now three vital question has three parts also. We only talked about what are where are you putting your focus. Okay, if I have to tell this part. Okay, we only completed this part. Where am I putting my focus? Because we only spoke about problem orientation and outcome orientation. okay how am i feeling how to take care how to know that yes anxiety is increasing how to know that yes i am feeling inspired what what shall i do to reduce my anxiety on a daily basis what shall i do to be inspired on a daily basis that is the second question that we talked about in the workshop and uh, how not to be reactive and taking creative action so we only spoke about, about the first question today so how can you learn the entire part uh, there's a there's an entire workshop happening on uh, on three week three vital question duration will be one whole day pura what you are seeing on this flyer is an online part in online we do it in 5 5 hours two days but when we when we do it physically one one full day we are planning to do this on 16th of october okay you you may write down the date 16th of october in pune this is rupa's number please get in touch with her if you are interested if you are keen to do it uh, for yourself and your team please uh, in in open workshop okay you will be given 66 pages workbook with all the question in depth with all the steps how the brain works in the reactive zone what all tools you can use just to reduce anxiety there are two pages 
only on tools how to reduce an anxiety. So there are two pages spent on that. And even as a leader, as a coach, as a as a uh, as a department head, anybody who is coming to you, how to coach that person so that that person does not come as a victim, does not come only with problems. That person you can equip to find their own solutions. So that is all we can learn. Uh, I'll I'll share this with uh, uh, Shailendraji. So he can share this with all of you so that you know what all outcomes you can get. So the price for it is uh, 10,000 plus GST. It is 11,800. Go ahead. Entire day. It will be from 9 a.m. to 7 p.m., 10, 10 hours total. Okay. Obviously, a lot of metaphor. And there is a pre-work also to be done and then come into the workshop. So all those who register, we give, ask them to do this task five days prior to the workshop. So all these things done and uh, you learn all these things. Okay, so let, let me close up with this thing. Choice is always yours to be in the old way or learn three vital questions and create the new way. And uh, creating a new way is always the work of the creator. And we always end this program with Namaste. Why? Namaste itself means I salute the creator within you. And here all the creators, okay, you, 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 you must be facing a lot of drama in your organization, in your personal life, professional life. Okay, you as a creator, you all have the strength to create solution in the same drama. And I pray that all of you uh, get out of your day-to-day -day -day drama. No more drama anymore. Thank you. Namaste. God bless. All from myself. Thank you. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you, sir. Yes, G. Thank you, sir, for the wonderful session. Um, audience, if you have any questions, any doubts, uh, please unmute yourself. And uh, or if you don't feel like uh, unmuting, you can either drop them in the chat box. Yes. Also in the chat box. Um, Rupa Ma'am has shared some links, Instagram, Facebook, and LinkedIn. If you want to know more queries on the sessions of the past, I think they can go to it and check. Yeah, uh, I've written a lot of articles uh, only on normal drama. So you, you can go through that also. It's on my LinkedIn, it's on my um, Facebook page. Hmm. Shailendraji, thank you so much for inviting. Pratik, uh, yeah. Uh, Pratik, I'm in the position. I'm just having one uh, question for you. Yeah. See, outcome and election. Everything depends on the situation. Not able to hear. I'm sorry, I'm not able to hear you. Uh, the voice is cracking. I'll stop a bit. No, no. Now, while this is happening, while this is happening, he is going through a problem with his Abhi ban hona tha. Ek saal. So, on, on a small phone thing, you, you can go there. I mean, you go out, you get stuck in traffic. Problem. Arey, yaar, har bar mein attack jata hoon That's a problem orientation. Problem with his खाना जल गया प्रॉब्लम फिस भी सुबह सुकृति को फोन करती है भाई बोल के आज हम नहीं आ रहे हैं प्रॉब्लम फिस भी आज ही नहीं आना था आज मेरा सबसे बड़ा मीटिंग था यस आई आई रेड दैट आउटकम बेस्ड आउटकम इज बेस्ड ऑन द सिचुएशन देन हाउ विल इट इंपैक्ट ऑन अ डे टू डे बेसिस ओके आउटकम इज ऑलवेज बेस्ड ऑन योर इनर स्टेट इफ यू लुक एट दैट uh, Ocean Beach wala example, two couples, one was happy, internally they were happy, they were only focusing on something good that is happening good, the other couple was only focusing on something that is happening bad, because they are internally happy or internally sad, the behavior, the outcome will be the negative or positive, so now deliberately, consciously if you are focusing on, like for example, uh, I'll just give an example, today I'm in Sinner, 
Okay, me and Rupa, tomorrow we have a workshop in one of the German based uh, German multinational company. So we are here. Ye uh, yesterday afternoon, I called up the hotel uh, receptionist saying that I have a meeting from 7 to 8. How is the uh, strength of your hotel Wi Fi? Zoom meeting kar paunga ke ek ka. He clearly says no. Okay, great. Now the thing is, if in the reactive orientation, are yeah, they are so disgusting. Hotel mein acha Wi Fi bhi nahi rakhte. Ab kaise karunga? Main hotspot agar use karunga, beech mein hang ho gaya, kuch ho gaya. So that is problem orientation. Now outcome orientation kya hota hai? Okay, what is the outcome I want? I want my session to go on smoothly. I need not, I should not be disturbed, and my Wi Fi should be intact. That is in the outcome. So what all I have? Great. I recall that I have got a participant who has a factory in Sinner. I called up that participant. I said, Ki, I know that it's a little bit, but in Sinner, is there any place in Sinner, there is an office or a house, where I will get a chance to sit for only 1-1.5 hours and I will be able to do this workshop. So he said, very nicely said, Sir, don't do it. Go to my factory. Mein jao. Okay. He came. He opened his factory at 6 p.m. Okay, I, I am here in his own office, in his uh, cubicle cabin. Okay, I am uh, I have connected to his Wi-Fi and this is done. So everything went on smoothly. Rupa is in, in her hotel room. I am in the factory. Outcome orientation. So when you are focusing on the outcome, it will be peaceful. If you are only focusing on kya gadbad kya, kyun ye hua, अच्छा सोचने की क्या-क्या सोच सकते हैं जस्ट जस्ट इमेजिन करो यार आज ही क्यों लिया मैंने मुझे मालूम था ना 21 तारीख मुझे जाना है मैं आज ही क्यों लिया अच्छा ऐसा करूं क्या कि 8:30 बजे वर्कशॉप खत्म करके फिर मैं पुणे से सिन्नर निकलूं क्या फिर मैं 1 बजे पहुंचूंगा विल दैट बी सोचने के लिए बहुत कुछ है दैट इज डिफॉल्ट प्रॉब्लम ओरिएंटेशन बट आउटकम ओरिएंटेशन सॉल्यूशन वाज आई एबल टू आंसर यू शैलेंद्र Yes, yes, got it, got it. So yes, I opted for new FISB. Oh, right. thank you, sir. Uh, with this, I think there are no more further questions right now. But if you have more questions on uh, two more uh, aspects of uh, FISB, please continue with the session uh, workshop that Sir had mentioned earlier. Yeah. And with this, uh, Shalindra, sir, uh, is the network fine on, fine on your side right now? No, Sugruti. Can I make it something? It's no, sir. Still, it's, I'm still it, having some problem. Okay, sir. Then I'll continue with delivering the vote of thanks. I would like to thank uh, yes. Firstly Shalinda, sir, for being a wonderful bridge between us, OHR, and the session orienter, sir, and giving us insight to such wonderful, non thoughtable uh, events in life, which we can, you know, turn around and give a wonderful outcome to it rather than just being anxious about it. Thank you, Rupa ma'am, for assisting us and helping us with the session and everyone for joining in the session and uh, giving us your valuable time. And uh, you, I have- Thank you, thank you so much. And I have uh, some announcements to be made. That is a uh, half day interactive training program on psychological safety in the workplace will be done by Dr. Rashali Rawat and uh, the further details will be shared soon. And also the sixth batch of win-win collective bargaining by Mr. Sudhir Patak uh, will also be done on very soon basis, but uh, the dates will be announced in later on. So with this, uh, I end up from my side. Thank you, sir, for being with us and thank you everyone for your time. Thank you, thank you. God bless Have you. a happy week. Thank, thank, thank you. Enjoy, enjoy. Thank you, love it. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. good night. Thank you. Thank you.